All right, it's five o'clock in the morning and I'm getting up this early because we are gonna go out and fly another mountain. And so I'm gonna try to wake up here, then I'm gonna go pick up uh, my friend. Then we're gonna f drive out maybe, uh, I think it's three or four hours, get onto the logging roads and hike up a mountain. It'll probably be about a couple hour hike and uh, fly some nice snowy peaks. So I'm pretty excited about today because this is a place we've tried to fly a few times. We tried hiking up and at one point it was too wet and too foggy. And um, I've hiked up there without all my gear before, just as a hike. And uh, it's a pretty tough hike and uh, it's going to be a lot harder with a whole bunch of uh, weight on our back. But uh, I think it's going to be worth it because it's a really nice place. And hopefully it isn't too overcast and cloudy because sometimes the clouds uh, get so thick that you can't see anything really high up there. So uh, we'll cross our fingers and hopefully it works out today. And we're off. So as you can see it's still dark out. There's something very very wrong with leaving when it's still dark to go flying. <laughs> But I guess that's just the way it is. We got uh, rain here this morning. I think the weather is supposed to get better, but uh, uh, I sure hope so, because we can't hike up the mountain and fly in this. I think he hopes so too. Yeah, this guy, I don't want uh, <laughs> Sucks to be this guy on the motorcycle. That's good. Alright, it looks like the rain is gone, so we're going to have a pretty clear day. It's kind of cloudy, but absolutely beautiful here. Right, we are almost at the start of our two hour long hike. <laughs> uh, so we're almost at the trailhead, um, but we thought we would stop and take this view in here. It's just incredible.
Hey, we're at the bottom of the trailhead. It's absolutely stunning here. We are going over top of those mountains to get to our flying spot. The trailhead is right there and it's a good steep climb, probably a couple hours. Hey, that was a good hike. That was the easy part. Uh, now we go up into the forest. forest. Make us a little steeper, a little more technical. I think we're about uh, 20 minutes into our hike. So uh, we're about halfway up and uh, we've come up this super steep trail in the middle of the forest and we are rewarded with this amazing view. So we got to get to the other side of this peak to get to our flying spot. There we go. Other side. And it's just starting to rain. I really hope the rain doesn't last. Because I don't want to hike all the way up here and not be able to fly. You heard them. Okay, onwards. And it's raining again. Look at all the frozen waterfalls up here. Oh wow. Jesus. We're getting close to the top. All we have to do is go up there. That'll be the top of the saddle. And then we have to go on the other side of that. And we'll get to where we're going. So we're about, uh, what, an hour and a half into it? Hour and 45 minutes, something like that. So we're making good time. Uh, but here's where it starts to get a little steep and sketchy. Maybe about half an hour left. And if you look way, way down there, you can see the road. That's where we parked. So we are getting really close to the top. That's a different mountain, that's Mount Copley. And we were up there a couple of weeks ago, I hiked, and a few weeks before that we flew it. We actually flew right up to that weather station. The last time we hiked, we hiked up to that weather station. But that's not where we're going. Look at that valley. We are going up over that. No, oh, look at this ice. Oh. It's pure ice. Okay, we're like 10 minutes from where we're gonna fly. But 
we are really close to the top where we are going to be. In the meantime, check out this magnificent view. This is our amazing flying spot. It's a beautiful lake. You can see a reflection of the mountains and the lake and the clouds. And we've got this amazing thing right here. So I cannot wait to fly. And the sun's coming out. It's getting a little bright. But it'll warm us up because it's kind of cold up here.
right. That was amazing. Um, so we flew, I don't know, like six or seven packs here, yep. something like that. Yep. And uh, we hit all of these peaks and that amazing lake way down there. And basically we start our journey back. It's about a two hour hike down and maybe uh, with three or maybe four hour drive home, depending on traffic. Uh, hopefully we do it faster than that. But uh, it was an amazing hike, amazing spot to fly, and an amazing day. Oh. What are those called? Something Jack? Whiskey Jack? Whiskey Jack. There's where I have to go down. See the road way down there. That's where we're going. Oh, that was awesome. Oh, totally worth it. Super long hike, super long drive, but it was amazing. Now to go home.